go. No. Okay, we won't wear a bow. Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. I hope you are all happy and healthy. Today's video is going to be my first ever sit down video. Is it my first? Yeah, my first ever sit down video. So I haven't done a video like this before. So bear with me, it might be really boring, hopefully not. So last week on October 21st, Alula turned one. Can't believe it. And if you haven't already, go and watch the 12 months of Alula Ruby video that I recently posted. That one is emotional. Um, but basically over on my Instagram, I've been obviously sharing things on my stories from her birthday and a lot of people have been saying, oh, where did you get this from? My little boy would love this or, you know, that kind of thing. I had the idea of doing a video like this where I sit down and show everything that Alula got for her birthday, how much it cost, where I got it from, that kind of thing, just to give some ideas because I know that when Alula's birthday was approaching, I had no idea of what to get her and I was like looking for ideas as well, so I thought this might help if you've got a baby whose birthday is approaching or obviously because Christmas is coming up and I put a poll on my story asking if that is a video that you guys would like to see and actually a lot of you said yes you would like to see this so these gifts are probably you know good for a one-year-old two-year-old probably a three-year-old as well because they're all kind of different ages she has got some things that are quite advanced so they'll last her sorry I don't know how this is gonna go with Alula calling around she doesn't nap long enough for me to do it in her nap time I just want to start this video by saying that this is in no way me trying to brag or show off how much Alula got for her birthday. She did get quite a lot of stuff. We do have a very big family. We're very fortunate and very grateful to have a very big family. My mum and dad aren't together, so she gets two lots of presents that way. Dan has three sisters and a brother. So we have a very big family. So she did get a lot of stuff and this isn't in any way meant to make anyone feel bad or anything like that. Like if you're watching this and thinking, oh my gosh, like I haven't got my baby that much or I can't afford that much, then please do not feel bad. It's nothing like that at all. It's just to give some ideas out there. Um, honestly, the only thing your baby really needs is you. And as long as they've got you, they'll be happy. And honestly, most babies are more interested in the empty boxes than the actual toys anyway. So please, please, please do not watch this and think like, like feel bad or anything like that. That is not the intention of this video. The intention of this video is just to give some ideas. So yeah, we're gonna jump straight into it. I'm gonna start with what we got Alula, so me and Dan, and then I will work my way through the family members as well. I'm not gonna show like everything because she did get like quite a bit of like clothes and stuff. I might show a little bit of clothes, but I'm gonna focus mainly on the toys. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> okay, so the first thing that we got Alula was a couple of books. I don't think you can ever go wrong with books. I think books are such a great gift and are quite cheap as well. So I'm quite a spiritual person. I'm really into my crystal healing and astrology and that kind of stuff. So I seen these on Amazon. They were like, I don't know, probably like five pounds each. So this one is Baby Libra and she is a baby Libra. Um, and it's just really cute actually. It goes into like what her traits will be because she's a Libra, what she's most likely to be like and like that kind of thing. So it's just like a really cute baby book. So like I said, on Amazon and again with the crystals, these are really nice actually. I would like to get them all eventually. They do one on astrology, crystals, their meditations. So you can see them there. And inside it just tells you like, like fluorite is for learning. And then it says like baby takes their first step. Hematite is for calm. So yeah, that's just a couple of books. Like I said, I don't think you can go wrong with those. We also got her this pounding bench from Little Dutch. I think this was about, I think it was about 13 pounds. And I got it off of, Ooh, I have to put the website in the description below because I can't remember. It was like Scandiborn, Scandiborn, I think it was called. It just comes with a little hammer. And you just obviously pound those. I think me and Dan have probably played with this a bit more than Alula has. But it's really pretty. I love little Dutch stuff because they look nice. I love the wooden vibe. It's just a really nice toy. So that was that. The next thing I got for Alula, which I seen this and I was like, I've just got to get this because if your baby's like my baby, if she gets hold of a pack of wet wipes, they are like everywhere. So I've seen this. This is a, from Taff Toys. You can see. Taff Toys, T-A-F Toys. And it's basically, it's just a tissue box. That they can pull tissues out of. So it comes with all these different colored like tissues. And then there is two like crinkly ones as well. So they're like sensory. So this would probably be good for like a younger baby as well. Basically, you just put the tissues in and they can pull them out. And Alula absolutely loves this. It was such a winner. I definitely, definitely recommend this. I got this from, 
Now, I don't know how you say this. I'm probably going to say this wrong. Jojo Mama Bebe? Jojo. You know what I mean. If you know what I mean, you know what I mean. But just Google it. So Jojo M-A-M-A-N-B-E-B-E. -E -B -E. That website. I didn't really find it anywhere else. I'm the kind of person that shops around to tries to find like the best price and stuff. But I don't really find it anywhere else. I think this is quite a new toy. Um, it's half toy tissue box. Hang on. And this was, I think this was 19.99, but I did find a discount code for it. And honestly, I think it's quite expensive for what it is, but the amount of happiness it gives her, it's worth 20 quid all day long. So that was that one. And then the last thing that I got Alula, which this is probably her favorite present. And honestly, I'm so, so impressed with this. So this is the Baby Einstein Magic Touch Piano. And I got the deluxe version which I think the only thing different about the deluxe version is it comes with extra cards. So basically there's cards here with the colors on and it's like an actual piano. And you match the colors to the keys and obviously it plays a tune. Really good for helping them with their hand-eye coordination and obviously learning their colors, that kind of thing. And music, Alula absolutely loves this. I think this was 30 pounds around 30 pounds but this is the deluxe version and i think that just the normal one is a little bit cheaper <laughs> all right <laughs> i got this from a website called toy street but i think they do this in smiths and like a few other places as well so definitely shop around for the best price if anyone's got any deals on and look around for your discount codes but absolutely highly recommend this this is absolutely amazing and then this last one is what Dan actually got Alula and I had no idea that he was getting it. So this is from Molly Brown and it's a little bit, what's the word? Advanced, should I say advanced? Like she's not gonna wear this now, but it is really, really nice um, as like a keepsake thing. And maybe she can wear it like on Christmas day or like for special events or whatever. But it's basically just a really cute silver bracelet. If I get it out and show you. I can show you that is so it's a really really ditty and it's super cute um silver bracelet and it's got her name on it and it also has um the birthstone for October which is opal I don't know if you're gonna be able to see this but it's super super nice like I said she's not likely to wear this now but it's just something that obviously we can keep as well so that was that so I'm not sure how much this was, but it's from Molly Brown, London. So, I mean, if you just, oops, a daisy. If you just Google that, you'll obviously find it. Dan ordered this, so I don't know the price. Next, I'm gonna move on to what my mum, so Alula's nanny got her. Um, and she actually got this a little bit before her birthday, but it is for her first birthday. So my mum got her this walker. I ordered it, but my mum paid for it, if that makes sense. So I ordered it from, a website beginning with V, it was like verte vertebrae. I, I have no idea. I have to, again, I'll link it below. Um, again, I love the wooden stuff. I think it looks nice. Um, she loves this as well. So it's got the little beads and cogs on the front, little mirror, and it also comes with four of these little shapes that you can pop in the holes. So she absolutely loves that. And on the side, it's got I think this was about £40, but again, I think I found a discount code and got it a little bit cheaper. So that was from my mum. My mum also got her quite a lot of clothes. I won't show you all the clothes, but I will show you a couple of things that I really like. So first of all is this two-piece set from, I think this is from Asda. It's like a fluffy jumper with little buttons here and then ribbed leggings. It's almost like a, like a movie colour, like a purpley beige mm, I don't know it's like a movie color um but yeah this is really cute again I don't know how much this was but this is from Asda and it's 12 to 18 months so she will not be in this just yet but I think that's so luff for when she's whizzing around in the gym because the gym gets really cold my mum also got her this snowsuit so I can I just can't wait I can't wait until she's walking around in this splashing in puddles this again is from asda i think it's got the mitts on so you can like fold them over or wrap them down if you need to and the fluffy hood i just think it's such a nice print with, like woodland animals on 
Again, I think this is, yeah, George Asda. Don't know the price, but this is 12 to 18 months. So things like that are really good because obviously they need that, you know? Um, and again, my mum did get loads of the bits like long sleeve vests and she did actually get her an Adidas tracksuit, but I'm not gonna get all the clothes out, but that's just a couple of things. Okay, next I'm gonna show you what my dad, Alula's granddad, got for her as we are doing my family. So the first thing was, bits are everywhere. The first thing was this wooden dinosaur puzzle. So just putting the dinosaurs into the little holes. And she really liked this actually. I think this was from TK Maxx. Not sure how much, but TK Maxx is always good deals, isn't it? So she really likes that. That'd be good for a boy or a girl, to be honest. So there's that one. You have that back, babes. My dad also got her this because I said I like wooden stuff. I think he just went all in with wooden stuff. So this is, again, this is from TK Maxx, I think, but the brand is Elton für dich. I don't know, it sounds German or something. But it's basically a little wooden book with um, this little cube. I haven't actually opened it yet because she's had so much stuff. Uh, it's like a little wooden cube and it, you have to match the animal with the background, if that makes sense. So it's like a little puzzle. Again, don't know how much it was. Alula! Hang on. Yeah, so I'm not sure how much this was, um, but again, TK Maxx, always a good deal in TK Maxx. And finally, when my dad first showed me this, I was kind of like, why on earth have you got that? But she actually really likes it and it's grew on me. It's not something that I would have bought, but it's this armchair okay like a kid's armchair again tk maxx is really soft and spongy and it's got what i like about it it's got a little sleeve here that i can put a book in so when she's she is like a little toddler i can see her sitting in there trying to read a little book or whatever but it's just cute like i get ready in the nursery because i don't have a dressing table or anything this is the only like pop and mirror we've got so i usually get ready in this room so i leave this in her nursery and she actually sits in this and watches me get ready so this is actually a really cute little gift next from my sister so alula's auntie this is such a winner guys i can't even recommend this enough as soon as she opened this alula was just like she just loved it and it's the first thing that she goes to like every time so this hoover fisher price hoover i'm not sure where she got it from probably tesco's um but it's fisher price she, she absolutely loves it the only thing i don't like about this is it doesn't actually stand up like i want it to stand up like that so she could use it to sort of pull herself up with but it does encourage them to walk because they can sort of hoover the floor and she actually does like hoover the floor so she absolutely loves this i'll turn it on so it's got the lights it's got this little dial it actually makes hoover noises and it does play music and obviously talk as well uh, like I said, it encourages them to walk, so it's really good for that. The only downside to it is it doesn't stand up. I would like it to stand up like that, but it, it doesn't quite stand up. Absolutely loves that, so definitely recommend. Here you go. Watch. My now. So Alula's great nan got her, I ordered it, but my nan paid for it, so I ordered it for on, online for her. This again is Little Dutch, it's the cutting fruit, so it's a little wooden chopping board, a little wooden knife and little wooden fruit, and they've got like Velcro in the middle, so you can use the knife to actually cut the fruit. Really, really good for their coordination, like hand-eye coordination. She absolutely loves this, she just tries to eat the fruit, they actually look really, really realistic. Uh, maybe i quickly show you so this is like the little kiwi and they got a little velcro and they just stick together like that and then the little knife obviously you use it on the chopping board and got this from the same website that i got the pounding bench from and again i think this was 15 pounds or some around 50 14 15 pounds i think it was scandy born again 
So that was everything from my side of the family. Now, if I do Dan's side of the family. So Dan's family actually got uh, quite a lot of clothes, which I'm not gonna show all the clothes. Dan's mum, so Alula's other nanny, got her these wooden maracas, and she absolutely loves these. Comes in a little basket like this. I think these were home bargains, actually. Again, don't know the price, but I think I've seen them in home bargains or B&M before. Loves these, she gets them in both hands, and she shakes them around. Alula has got a tambourine, a xylophone, now her piano, and maracas. So I love wooden instruments. I think they're really, really great. Again, Alula loves them. So something really simple, but makes them really happy. And then Dan's auntie, so Alula's great auntie, got Alula this, which again, I really love this. Wooden vibes again, as you can see, they know I like my wooden stuff, even though it's not for me. Um, but it just looks nicer in the house, doesn't it? So it's got, it goes along the alphabet. And then on the back of each letter, it's got what that stands for. Um, and it's just it's just really nice. I just think it's really nice. Obviously, again, this is a bit more advanced um, for understanding the letters and stuff, but it does help them teach their letters and like sounds. I don't know where this was from, but the brand is Carousel. If you can see that, Carousel. So I'm sure if you Google it, you will find it. Or again, something similar. I think that's a nice idea. Dan's sister got Alula some clothes, so some jeans, I think they're from Primark. And this really cute dress which is from H&M, I think this is lovely. Cute little dress, that's from Dan's sister. This next present I think was a joint present from Dan's sisters. Um, this is a Pilsan, Pilsan, I don't know if I'm saying that right the brand um so again this is probably going to stay in the garage now until next summer so this is quite advanced i think it says three plus yeah three plus on it um so she's not going to use this for a while but again it's a really nice thing to get maybe if you've got an older child um for the summer so it's like a little activity table you can put water or you can put sand in it it comes with lots of different things in there like buckets and spades and all that kind of stuff um, so yeah, not sure how much it was, but something like this is a good idea for a slightly older child, maybe for Christmas. I mean, you could probably use it inside if you wanted to, but I'm not cleaning the sand up off my carpet. So yeah, that's gonna stay in my garage until the summer. <laughs> so that is basically everything that she got toys wise. Like I said, she did get quite a lot of clothes, but I'm not gonna go into all of the clothes, but a lot of the basics like vests and socks and some just some cute outfits and tights, those kinds of things, which I don't think you can ever go wrong with, but Alula's getting restless up here now, and I think she's hungry, so I'm gonna go and give her some lunch. Thanks for watching this video. I hope that it's given you some ideas if you've got little ones in the family with a birthday that's approaching, or obviously we've got Christmas coming up. So hopefully this has given you some ideas. If there is anything you'd like the look of, I will try and link everything in the description below. If there's something that you like the look of and you can't find it, please let me know and I'll, I'll help you find it if it's not linked below. Um, thank you for watching this video if you enjoyed it please do give me a thumbs up leave me a little comment and subscribe to the channel for more videos and make sure you check out my other videos as well very emotional one from i made for alula's birthday and there will be a vlog coming very soon on the birthday party that we did we will see you in the next one bye